Drowden. Uh, my name is Sophia Singer, and my job here at Six Swiss is Deputy Chief of Standardization and Evaluation. So what that means, I guess we'll start in the big picture here with the radar that I work with, is PAVEPAW's phased array warning system. And what our job here is, is we are here to detect missiles launched out of the Eastern Range from the Eastern Range of North America. And secondly, space surveillance, so tracking objects in space. And the way the radar works is it's an active radar, so it's gonna send a signal out into space, and when it reaches an object, that signal's then gonna bounce off that object and come back to us. And the way that appears to us here in the operations floor, we have computer screens, and if you think of basically like a giant Pac-Man coming to eat the United States, that's our coverage that we're gonna see. So we're gonna see 240 degrees of azimuth around protecting all of the eastern coast of North America. And that extends out about 3,000 nautical miles. So when those satellites come over in our coverage, they're gonna pop up as a five digit number on our computer screen. And those are designators to us so we know what that object is. And then we're gonna collect the necessary observations we need on that object and send it to higher headquarters. That's key for maintaining stability on the Earth. It's key for protecting our warfighters. And interestingly enough, it's also key for enabling our missile defense capabilities because it's the bell ringer for missile defense. The first indication that you get there's a missile coming off the planet comes from that satellite or a defense support program satellite and warning goes out within minutes. And from that warning, we can then turn to our missile defense systems or other response options to figure out what to do about it. The most interesting aspect is that probably the fact that this technology started around 1980 roughly and we've managed to continue to make improvements to it still state-of-the-art technology and it can still track missiles in space. It can track hundreds of satellites and especially with space becoming more congested, it's managing to keep up with those demands. The coolest part is probably letting everyone know that I'm providing a service to the country and not only to America but to Canada as well that that missile warning you know, protecting all of North America. If an attack is coming, that I can notify higher headquarters so that a decision can be made to protect our country.